What could be more fantastic than the couture shows in Paris? Let's take a peek at what came down the couture runways for spring 2012. I'm Leah, and this is Style Avant. While the new fall collections are hotly anticipated in the next few days here in New York City, it's actually the artistry of the couture shows in Paris that are the ultimate indulgence, in my opinion, of fashion fantasy. Couture is fashion with the volume turned way up. From the prim lace dresses fit for a 19th century garden party over at Valentino that were apparently inspired by children's books, complete with high Victorian necks and billowing sleeves, to a much edgier extreme with the intense goth accessories at the Givenchy show, seriously huge spiked metal nose rings, gigantic hoop earrings, had the fashion world abuzz with its goth punk nod to the film Girl with a Dragon Tattoo. Chanel was having a very blue moment, 150 shades to be exact. The streamlined blue-hued collection was viewed in a futuristic space shuttle interior that simulated a flight skyrocketing into outer space. I wasn't really wowed by the collection, I'll be honest, but I was loving some of the wilder frenzied hair looks. And who can say no to a space voyage? I mean, come on. My overall favorite, I must say, from Couture was Alexis Mobile. I'm a sucker for bold color on the runway, and there was definitely a color explosion happening with this evening collection. Each look was boldly monochromatic, ranging from bright red to pale blue, with each model's face painted in the same shade, and then topped with an enormous matching tissue flower on their head. I'm talking huge. So we've got magnificent body-hugging gowns coupled with ultra-expressive presentation. To me, the show felt like the very definition of couture. I just loved it. And stay tuned, guys. We've got a whole lot more fashion coverage coming your way. I'm Leah, and this is Style Vaughn.